all right what's up guys how we doing welcome back to another video you can see here we're gonna we're gonna be doing some ai generated world uh world record attempts here we're preparing for the rainbow tourney on saturday me pando duck bavis and m hud are all coming together as one to create the ultimate geoguessr team and the map for the tournament is going to be ai generated world which is one of if not my favorite maps i love this map but today we're going to do no car no compass to make it a little bit harder and uh the, the record is going to be a little bit lower 43 to get to the top three and 56 for the leaderboard so we're going to have no car like no no google car no uh no compass to help out ai generated world is one of the hardest game modes there's like bait locations everywhere. It's meant to trick even the best of players. So we're just gonna, we're gonna do our best here. We have, we're, we're not gonna do any timers or anything like that. We're just gonna play. And so like, this is, this is what we got round one. You can see it's got no, got no compass. I mean, we, have, we can see the sun, but we don't know what direction it's in. I mean, if I was smart, I feel like I would just go Estonia because everything is saying estonia here we've got the classic estonia white flower meadow and these trees everywhere is very estonian i don't see a lot of birch trees so it could be like a latvia too but also this dirt color is usually more latvian and estonian i think the lithuania dirt is a little bit more like grayish white and also the road's very thin so i think we just rip maybe a nice estonia here i it could be a latvia too Oh, very nice, very nice. So far, so good. That's kind of why I went south, too, is because the dirt color is a little bit darker down south, I think. That's the only Baltic kind of meta I know. I really don't know any Baltic metas. These, I believe, are... Sarawak? Or Saba? No, I think they're Saba poles. Because they got the two horizontal bars. I'm pretty sure this is Saba. So, we're going to be in Malaysia. Malaysia, this is kind of just like a vibe, but the road and the white, two white solid lines. Am I recording? I am. I always got to check that. You would be amazed at how much my, uh, how much I ask if I'm recording and I'm actually not recording. So this will be, and we got mountains in the, can't look, but we'll be somewhere in Saba. Somewhere in like the flat region of Saba. Maybe like this guy right here. Okay. A little bit more north. That's fine. I'll, we'll have all of our four teammates out there anyways. I feel good about our team. We got chemistry. Individually, we're not the best. But as a team, I think team chemistry is off the charts. All right, here we go. Next round, we've got the black. These black and white things are everywhere in like Russia and Ukraine. So the question now is, is it Russia or is it Ukraine? I'm getting a little bit more Russian vibes here. So it's a little bit mountainous i think that's just a straight white plate if it was ukraine it'd be a little bit over it'd probably be around here but it doesn't really look like those mountains does it looks a little bit different maybe i'll go like there hopefully it is just russia all we need is the country streak and we're good to go again it's ai gen so it's meant to it's meant to trick you there we go okay so far so good i'm happy Streak of three is like, it's not even easy to get a streak of three. These are hard, hard locations. Next round. Mountains. Got these terracotta roofs, which... With this pole, I'm thinking it's probably more Spain or France. The lighter color pole is usually more Spain, but that could just be a bait. I think maybe... We'll, we're just in like a North Spain. It's either North Spain or South France. Everything here is vibing a little bit more with like a North Spain. So let's do it. Let's kind of go Pamplona. Now nah, we'll go here. It's France. GG's. All right, and we just run it back. It's all good. Streak ends there. Come on, baby. All right, we got these double white star lines. Probably thinking a nice little grease. A nice grease. What do we think about that? Everything looks kind of Greek to me. I think we would probably full send on Greece. I'll go Crete. It's kind of dry mountains. 
Beautiful. Beautiful. Next one, looking like maybe like a Lux. Is that a Polish flag? Oh yeah, wait, these guardrails, the white and red are in Poland, aren't they? Yeah, these houses look very, very Polish now, don't they? Yep. We've got lots of mountains here, so probably in the south somewhere. Go right there. Beautiful. That would probably be a winner. Alright. Tie pole. Never Lao. Lao's got yellow plates, so we're in tie. Driving the left. We've got oil palms, actually, so... But we only have one oil palm. No, we got more. No, we go, we go Peninsula. Doesn't feel like a Peninsula mountain, but we'll go Peninsula. Okay, good, good. Next one. Looks like Estonia. Dashed outside lines. I don't even think you get those in Latvia. Lithuania. Maybe you do. Maybe Latvia you do. Or maybe, no, Lith you do too. But everything just feels more Estonian too. We got the concrete poles. White outside dashed lines. And this is a nice cylindrical Estonian bollard. Okay. Never Island. Right there. Beautiful. Alright. Here we go. We've got piranha pine. We've got our uh, European piranha pines here. And nice little pole there. With these roofs, I think we always go Bulgaria. These poles. Very flat Bulgaria. So probably just somewhere. Would we go four in the north? Maybe three in the north and then one right there in that pocket? Very nice. Very nice. Streak of five. Almost a 24k. We're playing the game here. Very, very dry. Why are you so dry? Okay, we got these. We got the hex pole. Hex pole is usually Mexico, but it's like 95% of the time Mexico, but I think that's a colo. We got the colo kind of color differentiation on the pole. So this should be, this is like a three North Columbia, one Mex, I think, because this surely is like somewhere up here or there. All right, classic bollard here. This feels very, I don't know how to pronounce this city. Is it Dunedin? Dun Dunedin? I don't know how to pronounce it, but I'm going down here. You kind of get these like by Riversdale. Dang it, it's north. I gaslit myself. It felt so south. All right, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Got your yellow signs. But these houses, they look very Austrian. But with the yellow sign, I don't think we're in Austria. I think we're probably in Slovenia. The mountain part of Slovenia. Yeah, we surely have to be. I think the easiest way to differentiate like Slovenia with like Czechia and Slovakia, because I know a lot of people have problems with that, is the architecture. I think the architecture with these like these roofs here, and also the windows, like the shutters, they look just it looks like Austria. So easy Slovenia in the mountains somewhere north. Okay, fine. Next one, maybe like a PR. Yeah, we do have the antenna. Is this PR or is this ever like a Guam? Nah, this is never. We have no front place. And 787 is Puerto Rico. We quick send that. No problem. We're actually on like par for... Oh, never mind. We messed up one round. All right. Th these are the rounds that win or lose. It's like Russia and this country that really kind of sealed the deal here. 
I think we're going to be in Indo. Everything kind of feels kind of Indonesian to me. This pole is interesting. Because in general, I feel like this is more Kalimantan. But if with this pole, I think the only place we can be with this pole is West Kalimantan, I think. I think it can only be West Kalimantan. So I don't really like that. Actually, wait, do we have... Ooh, okay. I don't know if this is a meta for Indo. Maybe it is. I think I, I think I kind of have a good idea now. These pine trees, I feel, are like North Sumatra. Or like in the northern regions of Sumatra. I think you get a lot of pine trees there. The pole would fit for Sumatra. I don't think this is ever Sulawesi. I mean, there's not even a single palm tree. If this is Sula, I'm retiring. I mean, I think it has to be literally here. Some, or like, I mean, like maybe this actually. We'll go with this Nias. Because the road's really, really thin. Because this, yeah, this thin road is very, very confusing to me. Usually it's like an island. But we'll go Nias. Well, let's do it. All right. Hey, you know what? A West Sumatra. Hey, you know what? That's not bad. We take those. Three of 10. Beautiful. All right. What are we thinking? Very green. Very hilly. Driving on the left. Only really be one place. Got that ball or two. Now this. A big mountain? I mean... Everything besides that mountain kind of felt North Island to me, so I'm going to do it. Okay, there we go. Alright. I don't think we need this sign. We can get what that I think. Right? Quezon. This will be Philippines. We should be up north. In the, oh, yeah, and we got the yellow signpost. Not very tropical at all. These mountains look very, very kind of dry. Do you have any? Yeah, I don't see a lot of palm trees. These trees look, uh, they're like a little bit more, like, not tropical, more like a little bit colder, I guess. I don't know how to describe it, but I think we're probably right about there. Pretty good. Pretty good. Take those yellow siren lines. The red houses, easiest AI gen round of all time, just in Norway. Now, where in Norway? Surely in the south somewhere, right? Okay, that would, that's not a great guess, but then this is where we, this is where we go split continents here. Do we have anything? Nothing? Cool, cool, cool. Sun doesn't help. Is it crazy if I? No, I don't think it is. Okay, let's go through our options here, one by one. With this eucalyptus, we can do a little bit of narrowing down. Is this ever Australia? Maybe. I don't, I don't think it's Australian. These guys right here. Uh, I mean, I've, we've seen these in a lot of countries. Is it ever like a Mexico? Me have I ever seen a eucalyptus tree in Mexico? Is this even a eucalyptus tree? I don't know. Or is it just a dead tree that looks very eucalyptus? Because I see these a lot in Mexico, I feel like. And the shrubs kind of feel Mexican. Let's go Mexico. Maybe by like Quintana Roo. I feel like this is kind of like a Quintana Roo round, you know what I mean? Just vibes? I don't know. Speaking of 13, this would be a little bit devastating, to be honest. Cool. And it's Yucatan. That's beautiful. We almost had a state streak of one. Okay. I don't know if that was a eucalyptus tree. Maybe it was, maybe it wasn't. It looked awfully like it with the bark. But hey, we got through that. Streak of 14. Dreams alive. And we continue. But this round, I mean, the first thought is again, like South America, but these, these dashed yellow lines that are very, very spaced out. 
doesn't make me feel like that. But I am awfully confused. What is that yellow thing? This is never... No, no, no. Maybe it is just Mexico. Sun doesn't help. I think it's either... No, it's not Colombia because it's a metal signpost. Okay. We're going Mex. We're going to full send Mex and we're going to be happy about it. It's never, it's never Equa. Never Equa. It'd be crazy to go kind of Equa here, I think. What if we go Baja? No, not Baja. Maybe Sonora. It's a Peru. Peru. I never, ever, ever in a million years go Peru, but I almost got it right with Ecuador. Those road, maybe the road lines could have helped out, but that is a wild Peru round. 14's like almost, it's almost halfway to leaderboard. Leaderboard's 43. Okay, so we were like a third of the way. A third of the way, kind of just chilling out, practicing. A third of the way is pretty good. Let's do one more run. It's gotta be a good run though. And we can end the video on a, on a good note here. And away we go. I mean, Chile, right? Easy Chile. We have a stop sign. Okay, that is the Texas flag. I'm not gonna lie, initially, like very initially, I did think it was the Chile flag. But yeah, that is going to be the old Texas flag. And with mountains, man, I think we're going to go out out yonder. Maybe we're in like El Paso. Are we in El Paso? We are in El Paso. Beautiful. And I went right, right on the tippy top of the mountain. Smart. Okay. Here we go. Galway. Galway. I've been to Galway. We 5k this. Galway City Council. Galway Cathedral. It's right there. Cathedral parking. Uh, are we on this side? Maybe? Just go right there. Oh, we 5k? We 5k. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. And I think, would we end the video if we end our streak here? Maybe. This is Slovenia. Wow. This is Slovenia. I go like almost Montenegro or Cro I go Croatia here every time. But this sign right here is Slovenian. But this looks very, very interesting for Slovenia. Unless it is Croatia and I'm getting mega baited. But I think we'll go a little bit coastal because it's so dry. Let's go like right there. Yeah, it just feels like it. There we go. Okay, vibes are on, vibes are on. Next round looking like a nice little... Driving the left, is that... Oh, green plates, is that Bangladesh? Driving the left, we got green tuk-tuks. Surely. Nice little Bangladesh here. We're, we're having some good guesses here, so we'll definitely... Whenever the streak ends, we'll end the video on a good, happy note. That's not a great guess. Ooh, okay. NNPZ, what are we thinking? I mean, the road looks Baltic, but nothing else looks Baltic. This almost feels, it feels very cold. Is it wild to think Canada here? Canada is my first thought. Yep, this is AI Gen. These are not, these are bait Estonian flowers. Don't fall for these. These aren't your typical Estonian flowers. But could this be Estonia? There's nothing else really lines up. Like these trees don't really look Estonian. I don't think we're in Baltic, fellas. I think, I think this is like, I, I like Canada the most by far. Could it be something else? Absolutely. But I do like Canada the most. Like in Eastern Canada. Like a, no like a, a Nova? Ontario Nova? 
Rage? It's Ontario. Okay. Very nice, very nice. Not the right state or province. Streak of five, though. We're still alive. This is the most British thing I've ever seen. Yellow plates, white front. These homes, very bricky. Where's the bricky place at? Oxford? Sheffield, okay. Next round, very flat. Not a lot of utility poles. Is it just that one place? I'm thinking we're in the Netherlands here, fellas. Does that work? It's never Belgium, right? Looks awfully Dutch. I think we just gotta go, we gotta go Netherlands here. The South Netherlands. Very South Netherlands. Ooh, these are, this one's, this one could be it. This one could be the end here. Let's see. If we don't move our camera at all, I'm almost thinking like a US. I don't know. This kind of, this side of, that side of the river right here looks US. This side of the river looks Mexican. And we are probably not U.S., but now I don't know if it's Mexico. It's either Mexico or Argentina. That's, this is where the compass would be very, very helpful. Am I throwing if I go Mexico? I think I might be. That back there makes me think a little bit more Mexico. Let's go, let's go with a Mexico. I could be throwing here, it could be Argentina. I just like, I feel like Mexico is okay. Oh, it's Uruguay. Okay, that was never gonna happen. Dang, wow, what a crazy Uruguay. So our streak was seven, streak of seven. This would've been, let's quick, let's just, let's pretend real quick that we had that round. That we got it. Let's see what it would've been, okay? Let's just say we got a streak of 10 right there, okay? This is obviously North Peru. And now these are going to be unbelievably easy. Oh, dude. Well, this is Uruguay. Very easy Uruguay. And then this is a rip, probably. But we go Spain. Or Greece. Spain or Greece. Let's go, let's go Greece. Spain. Okay, that's fine. Honestly, I think my teammates are going to carry me in the tournament anyways. Pando, Duck, M-Hud. It's going to be all up to them. I'll, I'll be, uh, where, what am I going to be for? Maybe for Indonesia. But I think we got, we got Guatemala on lockdown. I think we U.S. we're going to be okay. Indo, perhaps. And then uh, Russia, Australia is where we pray. But that's going to do it, guys. Thank you for watching the video. Uh, make sure to check out the Rainbow Tourney, leave a like on the video, and share this video with your crush, because that's how you're going to get the date. See ya.